Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Cupcake Polishes Cleopatra, and I'm going to stamp some spider webs on it. I'm starting off with Yellow Stopper as my base coat, and here is Cleopatra, my cupcake polish, and I've topped it off with Posh as usual. And I will be using my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper, my Clear Jelly Scraper Card, Nicole Diaries Silver, which is NS04, and I will be using the Bundle Monster Black, which is called Straight Up Black. And I'll be using BM608. And then BM13. I'm gonna pull some Halloween designs off of them. So I'm just, you know, doing like normal, applying a little bit of polish, scraping, picking up, and applying them to my nails. Sorry, I'm kinda out of frame. We're having issues again. If it's not one thing, it's another. But I wanted to tell y'all what I was thanking Cerise, Cerise for. She had um, clued me into the fact that a lot of people are using the Yellow Stopper as a peel-off base coat. Now, I've heard this before, but I didn't pay any attention to it, and I never tried it. But I did try it with this manicure, and I was amazed. Now, I did two coats of it just because I'm kind of like a two-coat junkie. I did two coats of a lot of things, so um, I, I did give it the two coats, and I wore it for a couple of days, and then after washing some dishes off, I didn't wash dishes, but after washing some dishes off um, in some warm water, I came in and got my little orange wood stick, Woody, and, um, you know, peeled that manicure right off. Now, it didn't call, for me, it didn't come off in whole sheets, but that's fine. I'm not worried about peelies. Um, but it did come all the way off and I didn't have to use any nail polish remover, so that was really nice. So, once again, thank you, Cerise, for the tip. It's what I love about YouTube. We're all sharing all the cool things we learn. You know, and what works for one person might not work for another. So, but while I'm done gabbing about that, I want to step on in here and mention that this Cleopatra polish blew my mind. I had had it for almost a month and I cannot believe it took me that long to get it on my fingertips. Absolutely gorgeous. The camera's giving y'all a good peek of it, but in real life, that thing was just insane pretty. I mean, it was just wicked, wicked pretty. And I thought about doing some other kind of design like a mandala or something, but I just, I want to get in some Halloween designs and you know that I'm really funny. I like to do I like to do things different. I like to flip manicures on their heads sometimes and use unconventional colors, which is exactly why I did the spider webs in black and the spiders in silver instead of the opposite. So there you go. Now you know some reasoning behind my madness. So I'm doing a little bit of cleanup with tape, and that's all I need to do. I don't have to break out the big brush. And um, I'm going to go on in with some Posh Top Coat and seal this design in. I really, really loved how this one turned out. I was just so infatuated with it. So, and I did do this on both hands. And I will have some swatch photos here. So, there we go. See, you get to see it on both of them. So, here we go. Go zoom out and get them both in frame. Here's what it looks like on my longer nails and my shorter nails. So leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Till next time, be good to yourself. Bye.